Across the country are enrolling for health insurance today. And this marks the fourth year the Affordable Care Act marketplace is available for consumers. An enrollment kickoff event in Raleigh helps navigate folks through the process today. Our Carly Griffith spoke to people there and has more on concerns over steep premium price increases. Jennifer Simmons works with the North Carolina Navigator Consortium. She helps people signing up for the Affordable Care Act understand what they're getting and if they qualify for financial help called subsidies. Prices of health insurance have been going up, but there's financial help available in the marketplace. Hani Zorar and his wife, Asan, benefit from that help. We save, uh, yeah, a lot of money. Uh, we pay less than $100. Per month. Honey says this is the third time they've been through the enrollment process. They've changed insurance carriers twice in order to get the best deal and subsidies. It was like about $700 and it went down to 88 something. The federal law uh, allows the increases to be covered by the additional subsidies. According to federal records, in 2016, close to 614,000 North Carolinians enrolled in the health care exchange. 89% of those participants qualified for subsidies. North Carolina Insurance Commissioner Wayne Goodwin says that means the 25% price increase in ACA premiums reported by the government will affect a small percentage of residents that do not qualify for help. There is a subset of North Carolinians who are feeling that impact, and that's where we need to, uh, to make some change in the law to help these families out. Simmons says even if you're already enrolled in the exchange, the best way to keep taking advantage of subsidies is to re-enroll. In Raleigh, Carly Griffith, CBS, North Carolina.